Hello and welcome to our last tutorial. And uh, this is a quick one from uh, Impetus. Today we are going to learn how to be able to install from a previous version of Blender. So if you're going to pull it from a much more later previous version, this is how you go about it. So like this one, it always tells you load 3.6 settings. So from 4.0, the previous one was 3.6. But let's say, for example, I, um, for me, in my case, 3.6 wasn't stable for me. So I tended to use um, the 3.5 version. And I have a lot of my plugins and then my settings over there. So I'm going to teach you how you can manually um, be able to pull that uh, data so that you can actually use that for your latest versions. So if maybe you were not conversant with the previous version or you are conversant with a much more later version. Here's an easy way to do it. So when you head over to your Windows Explorer, you will have to do this through your uh, Windows Explorer. And what you do is you head over to your users data and you come to app data. And on the screen, you will find a shortcut to it. So you can type it out and then you'll be able to um, quickly uh, move to the location but I'm going to show you the process to get there right away so on the roaming you'll come to blender foundation blender now you would find all the versions that are installed on my computer so from 2.79 all the way to 4.0 so I want to pull 3.5 data so what I'll do is I'll simply copy and paste create a copy of it so let's give it a few moments to be able to do that so once it's done, then what we'll just do is delete this one. But before I do so, let me quickly close the app and then we'll do so so that it doesn't um, worry the program later on. So what I'll do is I'll select and delete. Then I'll select this and name this one 4.0. So what I'll do, again is I'll load so we reload 4.0 let's give it some time to um, pick up the settings from what we just renamed depending on the uh, size of your settings from the previous version yeah it will take a while to uh, quickly install all the plugins and everything that you had within that so once it's done the screen would open up So once we've done that, now when we load, it loads the previous versions, exact uh, same uh, settings. These were the previous files that I worked with on the 3.5, so it moves everything. So if you check out N, it comes with almost most of all the settings that I have in 3.5. So it makes it very easy. So I have all the plugins that I worked with in 3.5, then I have the added the, the added um, bonus of having the new features of the 4.0. So this is a quick um, tutorial on how to move your files from a much more later previous versions onto the latest version. If the splash screen doesn't give you the option, yeah, this is how you go about it manually. So um, this is the last video. Um, please like and subscribe, like the video, and I'll catch you in 2024. Till then, have a happy new year. Bye.